The for command allows us to specify a list of commands, an action list, to repeatedly execute once for each word from a word list. The for command allows us to specify a variable name to put the words in. The variable comes immediately after the for command. The variable can be any variable you wish. If it existed before, it will be overwritten. Otherwise, it gets created. After the variable name, we put the keyword in and supply the list of words. Words are simply characters separated by spaces. If you wish to have a space in a word, in other words, your word is actually a phrase or longer data item, simply escape the space. The word list is terminated with a semicolon and followed with the do keyword. After the do keyword, we have the commands to be executed once for each word in the list. The commands to be executed may be simple or may be complex. The list of commands to execute is terminated with the keyword done. After you enter done, the loop will run through, executing the command list between do and done once for each word in the list of words being placed into the variable.